Hi guys, Dane here, and welcome to my, what are we in, March 2021 booktube shout outs as always there are 10 channels that i'm going to shout out they're all linked to below some of these are ones that i haven't watched as much uh, so i don't necessarily have as much to say about them but they are still great channels and i wanted to make sure i'm shaking things up and not just shouting out the same channels so channel number one we have ryan from madman reads and rocks ryan is also known as ryan luera i don't know why he's also known as it it's just his name uh he's an author as well i've not read any of his work yet but i have collaborated with him on a poem which was a lot of fun uh, and his channel is just great although ryan you should bring back fernie the dinosaur <laughs> Up number two, we have Working Man Reads, Down to Earth, Booktuber, read some interesting selections of books, and uh, yes, yeah, definitely one you should go ahead and check out if you haven't already. Number three, we have Time with Books, who I think used to be called Time for Books. Uh, as you can see from the video that I'm using here, her channel recently, uh, she's got a new place and so she's been doing a lot of work on it. And uh, so at the moment it's kind of cool, I'm getting to see her like house come into shape. Um, but I'm sure she'll spend some time with books soon as well, so yeah. Then we have Mark Nash. Mark is another one of those booktuber who's also an author. Um, He's um, actually done fairly well. I know he's been nominated for at least one uh, literary award. He's, I think he's got two or three books out at least. Uh, he's got a really cool little reading uh, shed area, or at least he used to. Although I think he was having problems with damp last time I checked in with that. But uh, yeah, great channel, very thoughtful, uh, and he's a very intellectual, intelligent guy as well. So um, he's one like if you like your Steve Donahue's, you're going to like your Mark Nash's. Then we have the bookish report, Alex. Alex is a great guy, he's got a great accent as well because he's from up north, he's from up north, up north England. I don't know, what, oh, that's not a northern accent. I'm from Birmingham, I come from Birmingham, I'm a brummie. But um, yeah, he's great, uh, he does a lot of like author interviews and stuff as well and also reads uh, pretty in line with me. Uh, which is good because it means I can get some uh, book recommendations from him. Then we have E.D. Lewis Reviews. I mean the name says it all, E.D. Lewis Reviews. Uh, so again, I think E.D. Lewis is an author as well. I'm pretty sure they are. And um, yeah, some great content in there. I, I for one am a big fan of reviews, although I quite often just watch reviews of books that I've already read. <laughs> I'm terrible for doing that. But um, I do think there should be more reviews on uh, Booktube, so yeah. Then we have Fantasy Distractions, which are like, uh, I guess, podcasts. Um, although they're kind of video casts as well. They're just some great fantasy distractions. It's one of those I quite often just see the old episode in my suggestions and go and listen and have it on in the background. Then we have Jashana, who used to be Jashana C. I love Jashana's channel specifically, I think, for her one second of every day vlogs. Those are great. Um, we don't necessarily have similar tastes in books, but having said that, there is some crossover, uh, and I just find that she's one of those booktubers I watch for her personality as opposed to her books, you know. Then we have Mike G's Eclectic Reads. This is one for personality and books, I guess. I mean, as, as you can guess from the title, Mike G has an eclectic taste, so you're bound to find something no matter what your tastes are. Especially if you're like me and like Mike and you have an eclectic taste, you know. And then we have Spinelli Speaks. So I've given Spinelli Speaks a shout out on the channel before, but I wanted to give her another one because great content. Um, just really like, actually very quite nicely polished, I find for like her channel size and how long she's been on the platform. Just really well done, well put together videos that are a lot of fun to watch. What more could you ask for? So there we have it, that's a quick lowdown on 10 booktube channels I would recommend checking out. As always, the links are all below in the description box. Uh, you can hit subscribe to any of those, you can hit subscribe to myself if you like. Let me know in the comments what channels you've discovered recently and you think I should check out. Uh, I guess hit that subscribe button for more and I'll see you soon for another bookish video. Please hit that like button, thanks, bye bye.